So because you personally never saw anybody from your generation self-harm, that must mean it never happened. <sighs> self-harm has literally been around for many generations prior to your generation. Just because you didn't see it doesn't mean it wasn't happening. See, the problem is, is even within my generation and generations prior, children were seen, they were not heard. No one's sitting here trying to excuse why we self-harmed as a child. We're trying to explain why we self-harmed as a child. You're the one trying to make excuses as to why parents use physical violence to punish their children when they're bad. And the why for every different child is different. See some children self-harm because it's a release of endorphins and, and it is a way for them to escape their emotional pain. And for other children like myself, when I was a child, I self-harmed because I wanted to hurt myself. I believed that whenever I made a mistake as a child, I deserved to be physically punished for it because I was bad. A lot less to do with not being able to take consequences for my actions. Some children can get whooped and be just fine. Other children get whooped and are completely traumatized. Some children get whooped and they grow up and think that it's okay to put their hands on other people. Other children get whooped, like myself, and internalize it as self-hatred, leading to me wanting to hurt myself whenever I made a mistake. It's simple, really. You just have to open your mind just a little bit.